Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am here to share a haul with you from K Scented Melts. So, I have loved K for, it feels like forever. Um, she is definitely one of my absolute most favorite vendors, um, which means that I have a lot of her wax. So, I was holding off ordering um, until I worked through the scent shot cups because she has changed over to um, clams and then obviously she still order um, offers like the loaves and her custom cuts or K cuts. I can never remember what they're called. I'm sorry. But anyway, this order um, is was actually a gift from my mother-in-law for Mother's Day. So, um, we're just going to jump right in. Here is Carla's card with her information. Love her. Um, always responds if you have a question. Um, very easy to get in touch with. Always appreciate that. So, the box came like this. Thank you. Um, your purchase made my day. I hope this package brightens yours. And then it just says, hi, Susan, right there. All right, so we're going to get right into this. I'm just going to pull and go. Um, I did want to tell you that each of her samples come wrapped in tissue paper. So I will try to remove those. Okay, so the first sample is in Spearmint, which I absolutely love. I've had her Spearmint before. Mm, yes, delicious. It's like gum, Spearmint, but I love that. And they're two cute little candy-looking pieces. Um, the next, we have Bonsai, which, oh my gosh, please. I've talked so much about this. And it's a cute little, like, ladybug and a butterfly. Um, absolutely love this. If you love clean and green, oh, my gosh, long-lasting powerhouses, Bonsai is your friend. I'm not going to go over scent descriptions um, just because. The next sample is in Amber Noir, Avo Bath, Bamboo, and Sugar Cane. So I'm guessing that this was somebody's custom. Oh, good Lord. This is delicious. Avo Bath, front and center. The bamboo and uh, sugar cane is right there. I'm not really getting her amber, which I'm fine with. Um, but very generous sample here as well. succulent strawberry and they are adorable little strawberries yes and I would agree this is definitely succulent you it's strawberry and you get a bit of that greenness like of the vine of the stem mm, yummy I am on such a strawberry kick so we have that we have Morocco Orchid and Pink Amber, also adorable strawberries as well, which I do have a clam in this. Um, I've never tried that, that scent before, so excited for that. We have Boom Boom, and it's cute in little like beach shells, um, very fitting for this blend. I have... I have her Boom Boom and Sunshot Cup still, um, but it is a love, so there is that. And, ooh, um, Garden Mint and Macintosh Apple, and this is Kai. I'm going to call it Kai. I don't think it's K. I think it's Kai just because I have a student that spells his name that way and his name is Kai. Oh, this is lovely. That garden mint is fierce. 
in a beautiful way. And then with the Macintosh apple. And it has a, like a honeybee. I'm guessing it's a honeybee. That's what I'm calling it right there. Lovely. And Hi Chew in pineapple, um, which my youngest son is like obsessed with these. Um, so I will put that aside for Mr. Nicholas to have. Okay, let's start with my loaf that I got. So I just want to call things the right names. I have my invoice right here. Um, oh, I did want to share. So the invoice says, as always, Susan, we thank you so much with a heart. Um, and then on the back... Now, she did email me, so it's not like this was a surprise. She emailed me and let me know about the draft oil. So, on the invoice, she also wrote, We are waiting on the oil for this. Have already run out, but we were able to pour two clams with a smiley face. I have refunded you the difference. Heart, Carla. So, appreciate that. Um, so, I had ordered an eight-ounce um, thing of K-cuts in draft baby. Like I said, she emailed me a few days ago or, and telling me that, that um, she had been waiting for this, I think for like 10 days or something like that. And it still hadn't shipped. So very kind, love communication. Um, no problem. Um, she refunded me half of the price of the K-cuts, which would have been 11.20. So there's that. Um, so yes. All right. So getting back to what I was going to show you is her, her rosebud loaf. This is 16 ounces, which this was a splurge because it was a Mother's Day gift. So that is the beauty of this. Now I have only ever had this rose loaf from one other vendor. It was so many years ago. Gosh, seven years ago, I'm going to say, because I didn't even live in this house, and we've been here five years. Um, of the beautiful rosebud loaf. Um, so anyway, this is 16 ounces. It was $23.30, and it is in sun-drenched apricot rose. I know I could have gone all out and customized something, but I love this so much. Oh my gosh. And I am not a Rose fan, but this is an absolutely gorgeous, beautiful um, scent to me that this is what I picked. So really, really beautiful. Um, cannot wait warm this. This is so, such a gorgeous, such a gorgeous um, fragrance for the summer, in my opinion. I love it. I'm not a fan of rose. I do not get rose with that. It just screams summer to me. Absolutely love it. I bought 6,542 Sunshot Cups in this, so I had to get some more. Okay. Moving right along. Okay, so here is the draft, and it's in draft, draft Active Baby. Okay, so I got two. I had ordered, like I said, the eight ounce in the K's Cuts. She ran out, so she poured two um, clams. So this is not, this is Draft Active Baby. This is not the, um, the newborn, which is what I used on my children. I knew that when I ordered it, that it wasn't the newborn. I used that newborn stuff for so long that my husband was finally like, they're not newborns anymore. <sighs> you need to start washing their clothes with regular detergent. But I loved the scent of it so much. So the active baby is more for like, you know, once your child is like crawling and walking and it's still beautiful. Ugh. If you like those baby laundry vibes, I'm so glad. Thank you so much, Carla, for being able to um, get me some of that. I am so, 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 so happy. Um, 
I have, they're all, the rest are all, they're all clams, is um, Smell of Weather Turning. So either Danny sent me a sample of this or I received a sample of this, I think when she was like testing it out. So this is a Lush dupe um, and it's like beeswax, mint, it has cinnamon, which I never smelled the cinnamon in here. Uh, chamomile, oak, I think like oak moss. It's very nice. This is like, smell of weather turning. I was going to say, like after a storm or right before a storm. Fantastic, fantastic scents. Um, I love this in my bedroom. Really, really beautiful. French bread. You guys, I have not tried this, but I have a bread, um, from Rose Girls. I don't mind talking about other vendors when I'm doing a haul. I'm not sponsored. I don't get paid to talk about Avengers Wax. I spend my money on it. So, um, I think her case is like, at K's. um, Jenny's is like, I think it's fresh baked bread. So I do really like this. This does smell like warm French bread that you just picked up at the bakery. But I feel like I get zucchini. I'm hoping not. But I've been dying to try her French bread. So I went ahead and picked this up. I figured this would be great with um, fruits. Um, so we shall see. Strawberry pound cake because I have to. And I've had this a bazillion times from Kay. It is um, Bath and Body Works strawberry pound cake. It's fantastic and lovely and it lasts a long time from her and it's delicious. Um, so then this Morocco orchid and pink amber. I've never tried. I was very intrigued by it. It is the Bath and Body Works dupe. Oh, it just smells like you've showered, washed your hair, conditioned it used a really nice body wash. It has lemon verbena, apricot, cashmere wood, jasmine, and pink amber. Um, it's really, really pretty. So this would be, um, this one I really want to try out in my bedroom. Very pretty. Lavender marshmallow, which I am coming around to lavender, I know. I'm shocked also because I always just really liked Rose Girl's Sweet Lavender. Um, just because, and I know I've said this before, sorry if I sound like a broken record, lavender reminds me of being sick. Um, it just does. We They would have like people that were really into like natural things for healing and stuff when I was hospitalized and getting treatments and stuff that would come around and I would always say yes to getting you know, the oils and the whateverness, and I loved it at the time, but now that's what I associate it with, but my, I think my mind is starting to block that part of my life out, and I'm able to um, enjoy lavender again, and this is really, really pretty, um, so I'm excited for that. Lavender chamomile, which I've had, which I think that this is one of the ones that she has I don't know if she still does them. Those like sleep sheeps, which, oh my gosh, were they not the cutest things ever? She probably still has them. I don't know. I just went right for the bars. This is beautiful. Again, just a calming, soothing, wonderful, beautiful nighttime scent. Um, her Sorrel and Lemon Time. You guys have talked about this before. I love it, love it, love it. This is fantastic anywhere in my house. I love this in the kitchen. Um, I love it in bathrooms, bedrooms, the laundry room, anywhere. Fantastic. Rosemary lemon. I've had this before. It's been a long time. Beautiful. I, I love lemon. I love thyme. Oh, it's just, it's fresh and clean and herbal. Mm. 
just perfect for after cleaning or if you want to put this in and fake somebody out and let them think that you just cleaned. Perfect. I did get two of those. Um, apricot and crushed mint. I am a huge lover of apricot. I find that when it's in a blend with several other oils, it doesn't always come through, but this is gorgeous. It's sweet. It's feminine to me. It's not perfumey. And then you do get that crushed mint. Beautiful, beautiful combination right here. Looking forward to warming that. I don't think that that's one that I've ever had. Oil of Olay. So this is the old school oil, oil of Olay. The stuff my mom used to use, it was like in a pink, um, like square plastic. No, I think it was glass with a black cap. And that's what this smells like. That is like the moisturizer or whatever they called it, like night oil um, that my mom used, gosh, when I was young and then also a teenager. And do I already have a piece of dog hair on here? Probably. Yeah, so I love this. I've had this before. It's fantastic. Irish linen. Oh, gorgeous. You guys will hear all, all about my thoughts when I warm these. I just don't want to spend too much time. Oh, this is stunning. Oh my gosh. If you like clean scents at all, not cleaner, just clean scents, you must, must, must try Irish lemon. Oh, it's beautiful. After a stressful day, absolutely amazing, amazing. Bourbon, strawberry, and vanilla. Huh? <clears throat> Excuse me. Because of that dang strawberry kick that I'm on and I can't seem to get enough strawberry. This is nice. It's not, this to me is not boozy. It's not a boozy strawberry it's you got the vanilla with that strawberry and I want to say that I maybe have had this in a sample strawberry jam oh, yes yes please beautiful to me like June is strawberry month even though I'm melting it every chance I get I feel like I don't want to burn out her freshly zested lemon is my favorite lemon. That is what this is. This is a freshly zested lemon. And it is the bomb. Um, again, you know, I've had a million of these. And I'm completely and totally out. And I always get really sad when I use the last bit of it. Again, gorgeous anywhere in your home bedrooms, bathrooms, living space, kitchen. If you've cooked something heavy, amazing. So I did get, I did get three of these. Absolutely love this. I don't know. It's just, it's to me, freshly zested lemon is a beautiful scent. Like I would wear that in a perfume. I know. She has beach nights, you guys. I had to get it. Yes. And this is Bath and Body Works Beach Nights. Oh, this is, smells so good. I should have got more, but I was like, oh, you know, maybe it's not going to be like it because tons of vendors have um, Beach Nights and it's not like Bath and Body Works. Sassy Girl Aromas definitely is and it's my favorite. So I cannot wait, cannot wait to warm this. Amazing. Vera Wang. So... I wore this perfume. Mm, I'm going to date myself. Gosh, you guys, I don't even remember. I'm going to see if I can pull up the scent notes because um, she showed the picture of it. I thought Vera Wang had other perfumes, not just um, the perfume just called that. I thought she had other perfumes by her, but that were called something else. Am I crazy? Um... But that is the perfume. 
that I wore. I don't even remember. I can't. It was way before I was married. But it is a floral scent of gardenia, rose, and lily with hints of iris and mandarin. That just says compared to Vera Wang perfume. There is something, and I know I've said this before, sorry. When gardenia, no, not gardenia, never mind. Never mind. I'm thinking something else. Um, does this smell like rose to me? No, it does not. You get the lily, you get iris. You get a slight, like, citrus note. I loved this perfume, and back, you know, a thousand years ago when I wore it, I used to get tons um, of compliments. I think I worked at a university at the time. I'm so bad with years, but I wanted this to speak for memories. Um, beautiful. And then lastly, I have Lavender Sage. Mmm. Lavender with any of those herb scents is like pure bliss. Pure, pure bliss. And I have had this before and I love it. Again, fantastic for like nighttime. This is also like gorgeous in your kitchen and living space. Um, it's just so relaxing and wonderful. Um, so let me see. Her clamshells are $3.50. I think that was it. The loaf, I told you guys already, was twenty three thirty. Yeah, so that's it. Excuse me, her clams are two point two and a half ounces. So, yeah, that's everything, you guys. My shipping was $12, and it came in a medium flat rate box. So there is that. That is everything that I have. I hope that you are all having a wonderful Friday. Um, I will talk to you guys soon. Take care.